How's it going fellas? My name is Orosh and this is another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2 and in today's episode we're back on roads because apparently Bill wants something from us. I don't know where he is. He's in the general area somewhere. Oh, never mind, he's over here. Well, fuck off with this gun. Why do I always carry the guns I don't want? I can't even... I swear to God, why? Now yeah, whatever. The games keep equipping me with guns I don't need or want. For you, Arthur. It's really well, annoying me. Sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? Where are we going? We're a couple of the greys over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job. Needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them. And they're paying. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Hmm, are we? This seems legit to you, Bill. Sure, this place is kind of empty. Suspiciously empty. Everybody gets the fuck out of here. Yeah, let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. You know, I like every mission that involves the characters from original Red Dead, like Bill or Javier. It's not too many. Like they don't play a major role. They appear and they help us and stuff. Like Bill. Oh, I stepped into shit. They were saying the Catherine Braithwaite. Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Yeah, I told you this place is empty. Oh shit. Oh no, they killed the Irish guy. Forgot his name. You bastards! You killed my favorite idiot. I can't believe they shot. What's his name again? Oh, Sean. Alright. Oh, jeez. I don't know, they're all over the damn place. Where do we go? You know what? Since we're here and we're attacked and shit, do we maybe steal their stuff? Enter the gun store. I wanted to change my guns. Michael, you missed one. You're getting sloppy, Morgan. What the fuck you're talking about? I'm getting better each day. That was sloppy, you piece of shit. Do you see that window in Sean's skull? Don't talk to me about sloppy. Better in here, not there. Why does Michael have unique revolvers? I want the unique revolver like that. <laughs> Go somewhere. Also, what happened to Bill? Is he still out there? Yeah, exactly. Where is he? Couldn't get Bill. Alright, I guess I'm gonna let this guy go. Where's Bill? Might he get kidnapped or something? Always has been, always will be. 
Come out so I can shoot you in the head. Oh, they got Bill. I knew it. You know what, this gun has like pretty big range, so it's pretty surprising I actually got Sheriff without blowing Bill's head off. He was a good kid. Well, how the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. He was out trying to find a lead. Same as you, same as Hosea. All and got this kid dead. When things don't work out. Oh, and he so damaged my hat. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, Mike you also lost so his hat, but... Mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what? Six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't. Like right, he's not even like a, he's like a new member. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, he sucks. The boy's body. Bury him proper someplace quiet. Maka, best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight. Man, Micah is made to be so unlikable. And sometimes when characters are made unlikable, I kind of like them. But that's not the case in Micah's case. Because he's just a fucking asshole. He's just the biggest dick in this whole game. John has been killed. This town has been massacred, and I'm not even sure am I allowed back here. Still no Confederate gold. But a shitload of trouble. One day someone might find a journal like that and write a fucking and make a movie about it. Arthur. I would say it would be cool if there was a Red Dead movie. What do my guns look like? Not what I meant, I meant to do this. What fucking color palette was I gone with? Brown? Seems brown. Doesn't seem even seem like it's, a, it's like it's black, it's just brown. Let's get some nice engravings. What about the other gun? No, no, I don't need to ride with nobody like you. I think I was going with like black and the greenish wood. Whatever the fuck. So where are we going? Where's my horsey? Seems like we got only one mission left, and it's the mission in in the camp. I don't know why I didn't just came back to the camp after the mission. Whatever the case. I don't really like dual wielding in this game for some reason. I don't know why. I prefer to just have one pistol in my hand instead of two. So it's kind of weird. I was using it on for a little bit before because I was doing this whole revolver ocelot look. A revolver also I was using two revolvers, from what I remember. Maybe in the fourth and the second Metal Gear. No, wait, in the third one he did too, because he did those tricks. That was this moment where he just did so many tricks for like five minutes straight. Just to show off. And Big Boss just stood there and watched. Who got kidnapped again? Karen? Karen Duffy? I still remember his name for some reason. What's up? What's going on? Arthur, have you seen that boy, Jack? No. Oh. Where's my goddamn son? Where is he? Where's my son? They took him, didn't they? They took my son. Who took, Who took him? The Braithwaite woman took him. Oh. Like Karen saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Where's my son? If anything, or Karen. Where is my son, Dutch Vandalin? We will find him. We will bring him back. To I forgot Karen is part of our team. That he's not that just simply, you know, uh, tied to a board. tree anymore. Abigail, you have my word. Just get me back, my son. 
I will get that boy back, so help me God. Right John is definitely no. going with us, right? Just heard about Jack. You need some extra guns? Yeah, why not? Micah, Kieran, anyone strange turns up, you kill him. Rest of you, let's ride. Well, the shade. What the fuck is going on? It was just okay. day, and now it let's turned into night. That boy back. This really took him took us that long to get on those horses. Shit, we're riding like a whole fucking team. Look at all of us. Look at those dots on the map, we look like a worm. We look like Zuma, where this is the game where you shoot the dot and you have to like match colors. No. My grandma used to play all that, that game a lot and I sometimes played it too. Grandma always played like these like restaurant managing games, something like like Facebook games or whatever. But they weren't from Facebook. She just said like had someone, I don't know who it was, maybe my uncle downloaded a bunch of games like that. What? I've turned every stone. For Christ's sake, Hosea! But through all that, another perfect scale. We underestimated them. No, There's no gold. They underestimated us. Enough talk. So, no I thought Jose, I mean, Paul, Javier's gonna bump into a fucking tree. So Sometimes I hit like NPCs like I ride along with, just crash into trees. I remember Dodge crashed into a tree one time, it was funny. And he just like, okay. hit like a messed up face. This looks fucking badass, especially at night. Also, I don't remember that they shown that zombie girl, but I mean zombie that crazy girl, so I'm not sure am I even gonna get a chance to do that. gonna murder all of them. I sure do wish I'd to murder all of them. Put this fucking gun away. First song, now Jack. We should have stayed out of all of this. Bit late for that, ain't it? Quiet. We're going to fix this right now. Are we going in? Come on, let's get this done. John, you sure you're okay? Like I said, I'm fine. Follow my lead. Both these redneck families think they can ruin us? I don't think so. Why was Micah and Karen left? Weren't they wouldn't they be useful? I mean someone I guess have to protect the camp. Who steals a goddamn boy. I'm gonna let fly at those sons of bitches. John, I need you to stay calm. Okay, this is pretty fucking badass. <laughs> this music. Get down here now, you inbred trash! What the hell do you want? Oh, it's going down. All of them are gonna be dead. Easy, Especially John. wanted to kill that son of hers. We've come for the boy. You must have known we would. Shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged. Or otherwise, that is a young boy. That is not the way you do things. Hand him over. Get the hell off our land. I want to shoot this guy in the middle. I think it's her son. What are you mean scared me? I'm fucking better than those guys. Quality over quantity is... Well, you, you couldn't say about my channel. <laughs> nice, they missed. Ooh, headshot. Can I change the crosshair of my guns instead of from the dot? Because I was playing GT5 and I found the alternative crosshair be way better because it was like more manageable because the little dot sometimes I just like lost it I didn't know where I was aiming
All right. Maybe I should have taken that shotgun. Shotgun is usually a nice weapon for close encounters. This reminds me of the final mission from Red Dead Revolver. It was like in, in this mansion. And it was like my favorite mission. Because I felt like it was the most balanced mission where you had the chance. But if you just run in, then you would completely mess up. Why open the doors? Why just don't? Jack? Oh, shit. Get... Why didn't... Jesus Christ. I almost messed it up. It was supposed to be badass moment and I was just fucking... Confused because I wouldn't take out my gun. Where are we going? Shit. John, Arthur, we'll hold them down here. We Whoa. Got Almost got shot. Shouldn't put so many lights on them. Makes them easier to see. I can't tell which ones are the people I'm supposed to shoot. Fucking hell, this music's awesome. To the right, you say? Really not covered. What do they think they do with us? They can't do jack shit. I see Bill down there. This way. Or not. There you go. On the way. I can't see a goddamn thing. How am I supposed to help him? It's blocked, but I can't Maybe if I so just lead me back inside. Yeah, it did. That's what I was doing, but he like stuck with the door and I couldn't help him. Get over here, will ya? What am I supposed to do? Oh, there we go, I have to help him. I was just standing and watching him. Two, three. Shot. John couldn't even raise his gun in time. And I got the bow. So I'm a sharp shooter. Does he does she have the boy? Where's the boy? We have lived in this house for a hundred and twenty years. We never had That's long enough. Where is the boy? Who took him? You killed my son! Oh, and I will surely kill the rest of them unless you start talking. When did we kill their sons? Like right now or in some separate previous mission? Where is the boy? You filth. Alright, we get her out of here. What about down? Did they dead? I think they were already dead, so. I don't know, was there a point of shooting them again? Oh, 
All right, good. How about we burn the whole place? Yeah, see, Dutch agrees with me. Yeah, that would be kind of lame if he <laughs> burned inside. He ain't gonna. He has to come back in the previous game. What is this Jack is doing? <laughs> Wanted to make sure. Cribbage game. Sounds splendid. Let's let's go. That'll be it for the brave ways. How about the greys? Do we deal with them too? I gotta admit, the brave ways were quite more shitty. I like them less. Greys were a little more chilled out. Ouch! Don't kick me with that filthy woman. I never liked you. Why'd you take the boy, Mrs. Braithwaite? You stole Boys my Boys are off limits. You stole my horses. Ain't no rules in war, Mr. Matthews. Yes, yes, that's it. Where's the boy? My son Who has him? gave him to Angelo Bronte. So my guess is son Denis. Oh, are we going to big city now? Let's go! Arthur, come on! What are we doing with her? Leave her! I told you she was crazy! Angelo Bronte? Is she gonna run back inside and burn with the house? I think she just did. Damn, that mission was badass! Since shivers down my spine, it's a good sign. The tingling sensation of playing such badass missions that I myself feel out, cooler. It's gonna work out. Listen to Dutch. Now, I don't expect you to understand this, but I have never been more proud of you than I am right now, brother. You're doing the right thing. Son, I'll brother. Get that boy back safe. Um, she she'll kill us all. I know, but. Looking at this, logically... Why is my beard different place. color than my hair? They took him to scare us. Arthur was like Nobody blonde? A boy to I thought he had like him. light right, brown hair, but not like what blonde. Think, my boy will be fine. But, well, of course Marston scared rotten me. We killed all those people. We stirred up all that trouble. <laughs> for nothing. No. No. Not for nothing. For living. Now we get that boy back. And we go. Trust me. Hey Dutch, we got a problem. Not a problem. Oh Isn't no. It? A solution. Good day, fine people. Why did Man they just walk into our camp? It's Matthews, I presume. And who are you? Rip Van Winkle. Huh. Good day, sir. <laughs> this is the Agent lamest Milton, name you could have come Pinkerton up with. Detective Agency. Agent Ross. Ah, Mr. Morgan, nice to see you again. And to what do we owe the pleasure, Agent Moron? I don't know if you're aware, but this... This is a civilized land now. My chin fucking hurts. Them savages only to allow the likes weird. of you to act like human dignity and basic decency was outmoded or not... Why wouldn't back? we just kill them this right now? This is gonna be like... Done. This place. Even more problematic if we do? Ain't no such thing. It's civilized. It's man. So in love with greed, he has forgotten himself and found only appetites. And as a consequence, that lets you take what you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us? Who made you the messiah to these lost souls you've led so horribly astray? I'm nothing but a seeker, Mr. Milton. You ain't much of anything more than a killer, Mr. Vanderlind. But I came to make a deal. It's time. You come with me, and I give the rest of you three days to run off, disappear, and go and live like human beings someplace else. You can't What's wrong with his skin on his face? He's like wrist life and limb in this some skin I don't know. Low lives and murderers so that they might live in love. <sighs> Ain't that fine? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to kill all these folk, Dutch. Just you. In that case, it'd be my honor to join you. Excuse me. 
friends. I have an appointment to keep with. We're gonna shoot them already. I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. You're making a big mistake, all of you. <laughs> yeah, dreadful. We have got something. Something to live and die for. How awful for us. Mr. Milton, stop following us. We'll be gone soon. I'm afraid I can't. And when I return, I'll be with 50 men. All eh. of you will die. 50 ain't much. Run this place, you fools. Run. Come on. Get your damn hands off of me, boy. Oh, I thought he was going to call him and... What now? You know? We get out of here. Rage uh, and end the word. Make him even more evil. Know, big old house. He's here with me, is in a really insulting way. Which would make him a racist, I guess. Because I don't imagine black people worked in the law back then. Or any place, place like that. Lenny, go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. And John, we'll get Jack back. And we'll get going. Rest of you, get packing! Are we moving again? I forgot that Come we on, gotta man. move. This is crazy. This is still part of the same mission. We need a new spot you all right, girl? Follow me. Well, Go this away. is still the same mission. So I'm gonna keep doing that. But I wanted to finish. I thought I would get to finish the episode here. But we gotta go to Shady Bell. I don't remember what what place is that. Actually, I'm kidding. I remember exactly. It's that weird it's place right, where there was like some. We will. Who the fuck we they were? Move first that some psychos that believe the war never ended, and it was stashing no guns in there, and we stole them one time. That's where we got our cool rifle from. Just gotta keep our cool. Be smart about this. Smart? Are you joking? We made too much noise once again. We drove right to us. I mean, how many people we killed the past few weeks? I don't know. It's Dutch playing his games. Mosaic too. Getting involved with those two families. Master con men working their magic. They thought there was a lot of gold. Yeah, they thought there was money. Ain't there always? Well, we got no gold. Kind of sucks, to be honest. I wanted gold. Jack's gone. We lost Sean, Mac, Davy, Jenny. And for what? Who are those? See, this is the thing that I was thinking about. Mac, Denny, J Janie, Jenny, whatever. Like, does it, does it mean that like, like they s did it on purpose? That they still left out some part of the story at the beginning? Like, for example, there will be Red Dead 3 and it will be like the beginning of the whole story? Because I don't know what I want to see more, more of the Vanderlyn gang. I don't know, do I care? That's the one thing I really like that I, w I was playing Kingdom Hearts recently. And now that I played this game, I realized that I think I prefer voice acting when characters actually have like just speak like they normally speak. Because even John, that's how this, his voice actor sounds. But like in Kingdom Hearts, everybody has this really fucked up voice, and they always have those damn lines like they fucking reading a poem or something. And it just pissed me off because it's so generic and dumb. I don't know that game's story was Kingdom Hearts three story. Overall, Kingdom Hearts story, I find it to be overcomplicated for no fucking reason and dumb. It's even more complicated than Metal Gear story, which I like, but still admit that it's, it is not too much, too much, maybe. Just because the story is confusing and complicated doesn't mean it's fucking brilliant. Even in this game, you know, I recently realized one thing that this game, Red Dead 2, does really fucking awful. It's actually connecting to the first game because, well, actually, wait, I can't talk about it. That would be spoilers. But whatever. Maybe if I get, if I get to that part, I'll explain you why I find 
this game leading up to the previous games to be really shitty and actually kind of not connecting how it's supposed to at all. What is this place? Lenny found it. Big old run down plantation. Then Lenny thought no, it was Sean. We just go faster. I feel like I had plenty of dynamite before. Like you were saying before. Shouldn't be any trouble. Just need to check it's all clear. Now where have I heard that before? How are you screaming, Arthur? It's a thing in this game. I think every single line they recorded for this for the fell off. You ain't seen inside it yet. Come on. Sooner we get this done, the better. Like every line they have, sure when they ride on horses, I feel like they recorded them nothing. twice. Right. For Let's for when they're far away, and for when they're kinda close. Why do they keep equipping me with fucking guns? I don't want this shotgun on my back. I want only this one rifle with me. Thank you very much. Why does the game keep doing that? I don't know, it's just annoying me. Let's go. Let's go check out the house. It's them again. Boys. Oh crap. Damn it. Still some here. I can see that. You think there's more of them? I'll check the house. You keep watch out here. Oh, those were the Lemon Raiders. I just call them Lemon Raiders. Fuck. Could have kept the shotgun. Anyway, who cares about the shotgun when you got a rifle? Pay for every life you took. Come out with your hands. You can still walk out of here. What did I do? I didn't even hit anyone. There was no one in, in this room. I might have messed up and like detected Anybody some enemy from. Right, there might be someone here. No, okay, no one here. Fuck, I hate going upstairs in games like that because they can get me from all around. Look, if someone stands over here, I won't see him immediately. Where are you creeps hiding? Come out where I can shoot you! Alright, I guess I got him. You fucking dead? Alright. You better fucking be. I knew you'd come. Soon enough. You are some of a coward. Like you. The bounty hunters. The freedmen. The carpet beggars. Why oh, is he acting like he's all mighty? Criminals who stole our land and our government. I survived them all. Gonna shoot me? Our fight will live on. Jesus. <laughs> I don't know why the sound effect was like quiet. Didn't even have to shoot the last one. Good. Come help me with this, will you? There we go. That should have been the effect in the first place. I don't like blonde people heads off. That's why I really like... I liked Fallout 4 because of that. Like you could sneak up to someone, shoot him in the head with a shotgun and he would like blow up. Here, give me a hand moving these bodies. The okay. walking into this. Follow me. We gotta make this place nice and comfortable. Also, maybe clean the blood of the. What's going on there? All right, this way. Oh, that's a horse. Found we'll someone was jumping up and down. There. All right, then, John, speed up a little. Speed up a little bit, bro. 
I didn't. Oh, you fucking idiot. Get into the water. Okay. I can deal with the rest of the bodies. You go meet up with the caravan. Guide them in. That's nice. We got a new safe house. And this time we actually have proof. If it was raining. We can have some cover. Also, I might look around this place to just see if there's like anything nice, like a book or something. And the piano probably doesn't work anymore. Yeah, it seems pretty broken. But it does prove that this place used to probably be quite nice at some point. Can't even take the bourbon because I already had some. I have fucking whiskey. There you go. Don't see the reason why not drink something. Wait, what is this? Gun oil. That's always nice to have. Do you have any guns in need of repairs? Maybe this one. Yeah, why not? I like this fucking details of how you can inspect guns. Is that a dynamite crate? I think it is. So I accidentally didn't shot that crate. Because I could and then I would blow it up. Since here. What nothing? This guy took a really fucking good cover. I didn't even notice him at first and he then just shot him in the face. How about we now roleplay as an old drunk and I'll just like regularly drink up. You know what, this game... These fucking animations of you picking up stuff. Like I would much prefer if you just walked up to something and then like you would get into some sort of a screen. Showing what the place contains. Like, I don't know, in Skyrim, for example, you don't have to, like, open every chest, watch an animation of it, of you, like, opening the chest, maybe even, like, struggle to open it or something. And then an animation of you taking out every single little thing you had in that chest. But in this game, you do. And it also limits what can be placed in the chest, because not everything fits. Okay, the crocodiles eat those guys. What the fuck? I didn't mean to jump into it. So I had to drop it and he didn't stop moving. Uh, the sad music. Why is it sad? We got a house now. Well, I mean, we got kicked out of our last place. Not really kicked out, but threatened out. To, uh, my humble abode. We got fine living. And all the corpses and the alligators, it's paradise. I love it. Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, would you two kindly work your magic? Arthur, take a ride with me. Sure. Where are we going? I just wanted to finish the video. Yes. Could I have a word with you? <clears throat> Not now. Come on, Arthur. Where are we going, Dutch? Can I want to finish the going? episode. All I've got going on and she wants to talk? Everything okay with you two? I got far more important things to worry about right now than my Doesn't she said. love you? So, where are we going? Why would you, you go like that? It's mean? Dutch, you're a mean man? Sound. I don't know if I've done a hunt, like an hour long episode so far. Last three episodes were like 40 minutes long. Each one of them. But I didn't want to make hour long episodes because they usually suck. Because they don't need to be hour long, and they always piss me off. Nothing major. And John, about what you'd expect. He's taking it hard. We are going to get that boy back, whatever it takes. I need you to start asking around in the city. You think the voice actor of Arthur is making it up? No, from what I know, I think he sounds like that. He sounds like a cowboy. Which I sound like a cowboy and not like a fucking faggot. What about the Pinkertons? 
Nah, I guess I'm... Yeah, I guess I'm not exactly the worst, like, the worst voices. Especially on those, like, family-friendly fucking Minecraft channels. They always have those, like, squeaky voices and they always sound overexcited, like they fucking took drugs before making the video. I'm not excited right now, I'm just fucking playing the game, talking to myself. Just to be excited about. I truly believe the paradise lay somewhere in the west for us. But what's this? Like an abandoned factory? Looks cool. So Where we going? In the country now? Maybe. I'm still thinking about it. Whatever we do, we'll need more money. In any case, we have more pressing matters to attend to first. Are we going to? S I don't want to go to San Denis yet. Why are you making me go there? Okay, there she is, a real city, the future. Beautiful. <laughs> Big cities, they're always repellent. Exactly. I'll find you in there. I'm not a fan of huge we'll cities too, but yes. I don't want to be in there. I want to finish the video, damn it. Hey look, we finished another chapter, that's good. That's a good thing. Oh god damn it. Saint Denise. Saint Denis. I think it's supposed to be pronounced Denis. Saint Denis. Okay, we got three missions going on. Three missions in where? In the town. There's a mission for Angela Bronte. Angela Bronte and Angela Bronte. All right. And do I have to leave the camp? I don't want it to. All right. So before we reach 50 or even longer, can the camera zoom in on me, please? Can I? No. A little far away. That's even further, Jesus. That's what I was talking about. So see you guys later in the next episode. Bye.